This is uh, Centurion from King Cop Lock. Um, I came here earlier, but there's a lot of <coughs> undercover cops here. This is 203101, and if you can notice, there's light bars in the back window. This is Sutton Police, um, MP748, and I don't know if uh, these cars over here, but this is Connecticut. Um, 666 whatever there's another three four two one nine six eight um, if you notice the uh, the uh, radar detector uh, radar speed detector right there and three four two one nine six eight this is a Rhode Island car um, preferably a fed that's mg 742 if you notice the light bar is going across emergency bar is going across <coughs> i'm going to stroll down here where my phone died earlier this is a uh a van 1948535 don't know if it's a personal vehicle or not 2163821 nissan pickup a jeep this looks like a rental 273 um, this is G00104. Um, since it's a G car, I'm pretty sure this is a a, um, a vehicle with a bunch of backpacks on it. This is another Stady right here, I think. Um, if you see the light bars in the back, this is MP3403. Um, this is another undercover car. Um, the new plates, I've noticed... Uh, is M MPs which I believe stands for municipal police on um, the new registration form they have for New Hampshire 85830 I was told yesterday at social Sunday um, by a cop um, that uh, they switched all their registrations over in January so this is definitely a, a cruiser right here which they're rocking a brand new Ford something this is the guy that uh, threatened me right here this uh, M2 A2 veteran the guy came out of there it was very threatening to me Sheriff 4 is here Cheshire County Sheriff Sheriff 8 here Cheshire County Sheriff this is another really spazzy GMC 2733568 um, I don't know if there's any more in the parking lot over here but this there's obviously something going on this is another another uh, veteran right here it says Iraq X3 um, it could be part of their interim um, military training this is 0D A522 this is a brand new Ford um, so they have a lot a lot of people here and a lot of veterans here so I don't know if it's veterans training or this is PM0811, looks like a former Marine, um, which kind of leads me to believe that the militarization of police is on the rise. Uh, I've missed this one, uh, veteran, veteran, um, Lee L, another veteran plate, and it looks like uh, he's a cop of some sort. Cares Keen Area radio association so that's probably the union rep um, for their union but I do want to check out this Yukon over here if you remember from my video before I was following around a, a black Yukon the other night for over three and a half hours on Friday um, I don't remember the plate number off the top of my head but this one's 374632 um, GMC well this is a Chevy Suburban yeah so it's not the same truck because the other one was definitely a Yukon and this one again is all blacked out with a trailer um, I don't see any any other any other things over here I'm gonna try to go into the police department and see what the hell's going on because they got um, uh, competitive computers or computer solutions or whatever in that building they kind of own this parking lot so a lot of these cars might belong to them um, but who knows 
but there's uh, definitely something fishy going on here today. <clears throat> and uh, see if I can get uh, an interview going. I don't know if I can bring a camera inside or not, but I'm gonna try. If they tell me to shut it off, I'm gonna do so, so I can get some more info. I don't wanna cause any problems. I don't feel like getting arrested while my kids are being watched um, from a babysitter. I only have a little under 30 minutes to do this, so I wanna make sure I get a, at least an audio of me asking what's going on. Supervisor available, I can talk to real quick. I think he's on the road, I can call him right now. Yeah, who is it? Do you know? Right now, it is Sergeant Samarellis. Oh, uh, Samarellis? Um, you want to call him in? Um, yeah, I just, I just have a few questions. If he's out doing something important, um, I can wait. I can call him. What's your name? Matthew Phillips, JP. Sorry. I'll be outside. So uh, I guess Sergeant Samarellis is uh, the watch commander or um, their uh, shift supervisor. Maybe he can fill me in on what's going on here. I'm going to keep the camera rolling because every time I shut it off, it seems like something happens <laughs> and someone says something to me or, or something. Um, I don't have that much uh, power on this battery left because I did car block in Thursday and Friday into three from like 6 p.m. to 3 in the morning so I just want to uh, I'm gonna stroll over to the back to see if there's any cruises uh, parked to the side if you haven't noticed I got a cold I don't like secrecy I don't like cops hiding shit. Um, I think they should be fully transparent in everything that what they do because the taxpayer pays them and we need to, if they're the only agency we have to go to when something's wrong, we should know what the fuck they're doing. And they seem lately that they don't like to talk about anything. They are very secretive and quiet and arrogant too. Um, well, they play arrogant to uh, everybody else's needs. But this is a KPD's parking lot right here. Um, I've seen videos in the past. Every time they go by this point, they get all nervous. Um, so I'm probably just going to come right to this corner. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. I've seen this car before. Um, Lieutenant Todd Lawrence has been in that one a few times. And... Sure, it's been in this two times. I know that's one of their undercovers right there. I've seen them around. And this is their park and bay area right here. Um, I think they just do light maintenance. So they line up the cars every morning. I am not going to go in the back because I remember videos of them coming out saying, don't go back there, blah, 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 blah. I'm here to try to get info only, not to be uh, an asshole of harassment towards them, even though everything they do pisses me off um, their badge everything they stand for just aggravates me I think uh, it's regime Gestapo type shit um, automatically they think they're higher than the other human being just because they have a badge or a status or a label I don't think that's fair to the public, fair to you as a human being. I'm a human supremacist, so I, I'm all for uh, humans having totally equal, equal rights, whether you're Christian, Muslim, born again, evangelical, Catholic, Mormon, Jehovah's Witness, Buddhist, if you're into Hindu, um, I don't care, you, sh you all bleed the same blood, as far as I'm concerned. Um, I think we, we, we are all equal, 
and nobody should be higher than the other person. Um, I think we all should be peaceful to one another and respectful to one another um, with a, the, the highest respect for one another. This is a HOK NSN Roundtree Ford. I'm not sure where Roundtree is, so that could probably give you an area where this cost from. It could be a rental. Well, no, it's not a rental because it's a vanity plate. Um, Round Tree Ford, whatever that is, is probably where this this cop is from. But the cars are very dirty. They don't clean them very well. Something we pay for. They don't look like they take care of them much. But this is probably Troop C or something. I see his little uh, little hat in the back. Um, those who are tuning in, this is Centurion from Keen Cop Lock. Um, there's something going on at the KPD, and this is the one that actually got me a little nervous because this is from Rhode Island. It's MG742. You can see the light bar across the window. The back of the the back of the cruiser or the vehicle is full with paperwork and files and all kinds of stuff. So. Um, an empty coffee cup, but it's full of stuff. It looks like uh, they have somewhat of a Kevlar vest or something in the back. Um, I'm not sure. Um, I'm going over to my bag to where the, my scanner is so I can try to tap into what they're saying about me being here. I'm sure they're probably not too happy because they, they don't seem to be happy about anything. None of them smile. They're kind of programmed to be assholes, you know. Looks like there's another guy coming in. Um, they do have, uh, they do have, uh, pay, you know, people pay their tickets and stuff here. So not everybody is here for PD, but they're paying tickets because um, victimless crimes. The cops are passing tickets around. You know, if Samarellis just came in just now, he's probably going to meet me inside. I'm gonna shut this off for one second. Actually, no, I'm gonna keep it running. I'm gonna, uh, I don't want any dead time though. I might be waiting for him for a couple minutes. So I'm gonna shut it off for a second and start over in a second.